Hello YouTube modeling community. This is Rick from Skeletal Remains Scale Auto Restoration. This is uh, another episode in my series of called Something Old. This will be number 10. It's not model car related but it is automotive related. It's uh, a book that my grandfather gave me years ago and uh, it was printed in 1924 so anything you'll see in here is 24 or earlier and uh, what I really like about this book is the illustrations in it it's got some really cool old-school illustrations so let's get started because this might take a little while it's falling apart my grandfather did inscribe it I doubt you can see that on there but anyway take a look here see if we can zoom in on this right there 1924 it's Dykes automobile and gasoline engine encyclopedia and it covers quite a few things construction operation repair of automobiles engines electrical systems including trucks tractors motorcycles and there's even a little section on some aircraft engines I'm just gonna go to some of the illustrations we'll go through this kind of quick if we can here's a cutaway Let's see if we get a little better picture of the engine there cutaway illustration of the engine it says a uh, 12 all says on uh, uh, the caption it says a 12 cylinder automobile it's kind of vague in a lot of ways they do a few specifics here and there some of these illustrations are pretty cool Ooh, going the wrong way here this is about gear reduction and drive shaft and stuff like that you can see up there we get a ring and pinion gear here's more about that ring and pinion transmission stuff about pistons It's more about engine building, how it operates. I don't know how well we're going to see some of this stuff. The illustrations are really cool. I love just skimming through it, looking at them. This here section is about the fuel system and carburetors. It's pretty much typical, but they do have some specific stuff, including Bosch spark plugs. And you look at a spark plug from back then, it ain't a whole lot different today. The basic design is the same. It's about magnetos and magneto systems. More about magnetos. This here is about magneto still and ignition and troubleshooting. Testing. Here's some cool illustrations here. 
there are generators and uh, right there you have a distributor too that's on the generator This is about generators, field windings, and regulators. This here is about wiring. And let's see if we get a little bit closer. An illustration of some of those old cloth covered wires. Here's some schematics. Here we have tools and equipment for automotive electrical repair shop. They also have some pretty cool uh, electrical testing equipment they show in here. This here shows you how to set up, set up an electrical bench. Some of this. Here's some testing equipment. Some more tools. More electrical testing equipment. they call modern electrical testing equipment for 1924 I imagine it was pretty modern we'll move on a little more what do we have over here this section is about storage batteries and construction of them and how to test them pretty much the same thing you do nowadays This here section about setting up a garage. Layout for a garage and shop buildings. Different equipment you would be using it. Even show you different lighting fixtures to use. Yeah, this is cool. I don't know if that's for car parts or Moonshine. Check this out. That looks safe. <laughs> Another car rack up here. Another type here. Here's a guy using an A-frame. Lift up the back of a car. Have an engine test stand, I guess. Here's a, a press. Another guy using an A-frame to pull a motor. Here's a guy underneath the car on jacks. That's a whole frame on a roll around jacks. How about a tow truck? And here's how to make the tow truck. Some more tools and equipment. Yep, the drill has evolved a little bit. more tools, calipers, micrometers, fuel gauge, all looks the same today.
This section is about radiator repair. Pressure testing. How's this work? Cleaning car parts. You use kerosene. This is just simple uh, different adjustments, repairing and adjusting for different automobiles. This section is uh, about bearings. Use it, how to use uh, lapping compounds. This section about piston rings. This here is about a gas electric truck. There's another truck, two ton capacity truck. I also have a little section about four wheel driving here. This is about commercial vehicles. That's taxi meter. This here section starts covering some tractors. And this section about motorcycles. This here, I believe, is representing an Indian motorcycle. Kind of looks like it to me. But for sure, right here, we have a Harley. These illustrations, I love them, they're great. And uh, check this out. It's called the Nera car. I wouldn't want to drive it near a car. This here section is about how to build a race car. I change it into a more aerodynamic body on it and other ways of gaining speed. And then we have this illustration with a bunch of nomenclature naming every part. And uh, it's for a Ford Model T. There is a pretty good section covering the T. <coughs> Sorry. All this section back here is about Model T's. So anyway, I just wanted to give you a quick little overview of this book. From 1924. It surely is something old. This is episode number 10. And I'm Rick, and thank you all for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye now.